Okay, uh, so uh, the our website's still off with the web developer, uh, but what we're going to do today is get started on setting up our uh, Google My Business for this uh, for this website and this brand. Um, so what I'm going to do is jump over to uh, Google My Business. So I've, all I've done is logged in. Uh, and to to get there just kind of google google my business uh then you'll need to uh log into your google account uh, and then you should be able to just hit the uh add location button so km stonemasons Okay, so we're going to add a location. Um, so I've clicked yes, so it'll actually show on the maps. Um, there won't, there isn't a physical location for this business, but I'm going to uh, add one anyway because it's fine. So okay, so just give me two seconds. Okay, so just working through the options. Okay, so masonry contractor seems like it's the best option, uh, but what I'm going to do is uh, just confirm and see what the other businesses on Google are currently doing. Okay, so everybody's there. There is masonry contractor, so we will do the same. Okay, so we've set up a phone number for this business. Um, I haven't done that. I, uh, I haven't filmed doing that, but basically, uh, I've just used a. Uh, company called Voipline Telecom. Uh, so uh, they are great for any project where, uh, like this, where you're um, you know, not necessarily sure exactly uh, what number to use. Uh, you can get a local number. It costs 65 cents a month, and then, uh, and then it just costs 10 cents every time you redirect it to a actual landline number. So it's uh, quite cheap. And uh, yeah, the holding costs while you work out kind of what to do with the website are uh, extremely affordable. Uh, so I will actually I think that needs the uh, full URL and I'll just try with that for now Okay, excellent. So this is up to verification, um, but in the meantime, I can start to add any information I have uh, and get this listing to 100%. Okay, we'll go nine to five. Okay, that gets the uh, open hours in. Okay, so another thing that is extremely important when you're working through this is to uh, make sure you kind of write down exactly what you're adding for each of these. 
uh, because it's in extremely important to make sure that you know any time your address is mentioned, it's it, it's mentioned in the same uh, format. It's complete. Uh, any time the you know the open hours, basically all the information for your business is entered. Uh, it's entered in identical. Uh, so when Google looks around the internet, it, it all lines up, and that will really really help uh, to show uh, to improve where your um, where your Google listing will actually show on the internet. Okay, so I'm going to add uh, this business in as we'll uh, make it day. Uh, We'll go the 13th, that's when we started the business. Okay, uh, we'll also want to add a business description. Um, so we'll have to write something for this. Uh, we might do it a little bit later, uh, but basically filling in every single piece of information that you can, uh, getting your services in there um, is uh, incredibly important. The more information you give Google, uh, Google Places, the more, the higher the chance you are of actually Google using that information and uh, ranking you in the maps listings. Uh, so we'll have to get this to 100% um, and uh, yeah, work on this. And then, so the next one we'll add in will be the business description, uh, but I'll write that off uh, off camera because that might take a little while uh, and we have uh, 750 characters to play with uh, so the goal there is to use as many as possible uh, because we as I said we want to give Google every single little piece of information uh, we also want to add some photos uh, but we'll do that again uh, down the track a little bit once we actually have a, a little bit more of the uh, marketing collateral put together for this website uh, but the uh, goal for now was to just get the listing created uh, and get it approved so we can get it onto Google and um, and yeah start to uh, uh, start seeing it there and uh, we also need it for some of the on-site optimization that we were, we were planning to do uh, so I thought I'd get that on track now uh, while we're working on the uh, while we're working on the website so that's it for this uh, this video we will see you in the next video uh, which might be once we uh, have the website live and have a little bit more of the collateral so we can keep working through everything we need to do uh, and I'll come back and do a uh, full kind of optimization of this GMB listing at a later date.